hey guys welcome back to my channel in today's video will be all about my brows first I like to go in with my milk of magnesia and I put it all over my brow and I use my finger to blend it out and then I use a spoolie from a brush and I just brush it in just to make sure the airs the hair and my brows are in place and I like to go over it with my transitioning powder I use my Laura Mercier but you can use any transitioning powder and I like to dust it off and then I go in with my ColourPop bra pomade and Jet Set Black and I use an angle brush and I like to trace my brow first and then I fill them in. And I just follow my natural bra shape and if my bra is too thin I just go a little bit over to make it look more thicker. And then I just go in and I fill them in. I'm not gonna, I just fill them in how my hair, my natural hair grew in my brows. And I don't like to use the Jesset Blacks to fill the front part of my brows. I use a lighter color. And then for the lighter color, I went with my ColourPop Bra Pomade and I used the color black and brown because I like my brows to be darker and the tail and then the front to be lighter because it gives it more of a natural look in my opinion. And I flick my brush upwards to create thick hairs. And I like to use my Elegor Concealer in Chestnut. I go with one shade lighter concealer because I don't like my brow to be too highlighted because I'm so scared of flashback. And I just blend it out. And after I'm done blending my brows, I like to go with my transition powder again. Because uh, around my brows can get really greasy when I do that. It prevents my brows to get greasy around the edges throughout the day. And this method makes my brow last way more longer. I hope you guys enjoy this video. I know I'm not in the end, but I'm almost at the end. I hope you guys enjoy and don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. That's it for this look. Invincible.